Alright, hey guys, what's going on? It's Nate from American Wilderness, and today I'm going to address a question that we get a lot here, and that's what's the difference between venomous and poisonous? This is a pretty big difference when you're dealing with wildlife, and here I have an American toad to sort of illustrate that. The American toad, Anaxorus americanus, it is a poisonous animal, and that means that it secretes a toxin that is meant to be ingested by other animals and it will cause discomfort, it will distaste, something like that. If you were to lick this toad and if these parotid glands were to ex or secrete, I should say, uh, toxin, you wouldn't have a great time. It would probably taste really bad and you might get sick. There are some toads in the world, um, especially out west in the United States, that could kill you if you were to lick them. And There are a bunch of frogs too, poison dart frogs and things that secrete toxins through their skin that are supposed to deter predators from eating them. And a lot of them are really brightly colored. American toads are colored for camouflage, but uh, that's something that will uh, t sort of tip you off that something is venomous or poisonous is that it has a bright uh, colored skin. Usually with reptiles and amphibians, that's the case. Now, snakes, on the other hand, are venomous. So that means they have to inject the toxin into you. So if it bites you and something happens, that means it's venom. And this is the same thing with spiders, scorpions, uh, even shrews, uh, northern short-tailed shrews, small mammals are venomous and they use that to incapacitate their prey. That's what venom evolved for is to incapacitate prey. So don't ever think that a snake is really toxic because it's trying to defend itself. They will use the venom to do that, but they would much rather not waste it on you if you're messing with it, and they'd rather use it for their prey, because the whole point of venom is to kill something really quickly so the snake isn't injured, and then it can eat right afterward, because it'll kill it quickly, and a lot of them are really, really toxic and can do you in. Now, um, that's pretty much it. A lot of people will just say poisonous or venomous for things that aren't venomous and it's pretty important to note that there's different levels of toxin and there's different uh, ways that toxin can be delivered to you so uh, it's something that it's it's nice to know I think uh, I've known it for a while um, dealing with wildlife but a lot of people still think everything's poisonous there's no such thing well there are poisonous snakes in the world if you eat them then you will get messed up but uh, snakes are in general venomous stuff like toads are poisonous so Hopefully that answers your question. If you've got any other questions about animals like this, don't hesitate to ask in the comments section. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. I'm Nate from American Wilderness, and I'll see you guys in the next video.